next guests are joining forces once again to kick off the New Year's biggest party from Dick Clark's New Year's Rock and Eve. Let's welcome Ryan Seacrest and Jenny McCarthy. Here they are. Tested to those. See you. Happy, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Good to see you, Dan. Hi, everybody. Have a seat. Jenny. Thank you. So fun to see you guys. I'm really looking forward to watching the show. I gl I'm glad I get to watch it from a warm couch. I was yeah. going to say, you stay What's home? The, yes. What's that like? Um, <laughs> I'll send you pictures. Yeah, please do. It's, yeah, we'll it's post It's been those. a while for us. So this is your ninth year, speaking it of it be, being a while. Uh, give me a second. Let me start with you, Ryan. Give, give us a sense of what's coming up on the show. I know this is the number one music show of the entire in the year. world. Yes. Yeah, of the entire year, which is really incredible. Uh, if, you're, if you're going out, if you're not going out, we're bringing everything to you across the country here in Times Square, also in New Orleans and in Los Angeles. Everyone from the Chainsmokers to Bazi to Halsey Charlie Puth. to Charlie Puth, Christina Aguilera live just before the ball drops. Then we're going to toss from the, the ball platform out to Post Malone, who's performing in Brooklyn. So we're trying to cover all the bases and we start at 8 Eastern and go until January 3rd. <laughs> so feel free to just keep the TV on. That's so true. And I hear there's an obscure act that you're a fan of, the new kids on the block. I know, and, that's what I'm and, most excited about. And there, um, there's a story. There's some sentimental value for you. There is. Nine years ago, it was my first time hosting, and Ryan has been so, he, Ryan was the one that hired me for this job in the first place. I it was, was all about say. matchmaking, honestly. It had nothing to do with the show. It was really about finding true uh, love. Ah, that's what it was. <laughs> so then I, I was I was hosting, and all of a sudden the band was coming up to talk to Ryan to be interviewed, and I heard, "Hey, Jenny McCarthy," and I turned around and I said, "Hi, Johnny Wahlberg," and I'd never met him before, so I was like, little butterflies, you know, happened, and um, then I wound up falling madly in love with him. And now, so this year he's performing again. I'm hosting, so it's going to be very is sentimental. This, the, this is the first time that he's performing, and you're hosting since then. Correct. Right in nine years. So some some magic. And yeah, four years. That. Four years of married bliss. Four Congratulations. years of married bliss. Thank you very much. So uh, the following question, not so blissful. Last year was the coldest oh. New Year's on record for 100 years or something like that? <laughs> yes, it was. I, I think the wind chill was minus two for yes. the entire night. And we, what, were, what was your trick? I, we, I could barely speak because your jaw starts to freeze. We put those heat pads on our faces. During commercials, we're holding up those heat warmers yeah, Are there not faces? health warnings about that? Is that? I'm not sure. All I know is it was 9.30 and I started crying because it was so cold. And then I went, oh, I can't do it anymore. I quit. They go, it's only 9.30. Jenny. So I hung in there and um, thanks to, you know, my husband who kept me warm and the people in Times Square. There's a million people yeah, in Times Square. you think about Square. the people who are there all day in that kind of weather who have to stay in their in their spot and they can't leave. Well, let, me, let me ask you about that because you got a million people right out here and then millions more watching. Do you feel pressure? Um, not, not to psych you out. Before <laughs> the, the night. I don't actually. I don't feel pressure. I feel like I'm just talking to someone at home. Oh, I feel a lot of pressure. I, I, <laughs> I, I want to get it right, not screw it up, make sure, you know, because it's kind of key that we time the show right to midnight. So, you know, because if that's off, then, well, the whole thing is not. It this is work. why Ryan is such a professional. I mean, to lean on him, you guys, he's been the most professional guy I've ever worked with, ever. That's why I get the easy part, and he's the captain of the ship. You outsource your anxiety to him. <laughs> Let him do the worrying. I, do. I love people like that. Uh, it's, the other question I wanted to ask you about this is, is your resolutions. Do you make resolutions? You and know, what are they? We get asked that a lot. And the, the thing that I kind of contemplated on was, think of something, Jenny, for real. And, you know, I decided that self-care, I think that's the new buzzword, uh, but I've been going 100 miles an hour, and I've been kind of, you know how they say put the oxygen mask on yourself and then on your kids? It's been put on everybody else but myself, so I really need to start taking care of myself because I want to live a, good one. a long live time. Forever. You know, I've got a son that needs me, and mm -hmm. so it's going to, the year for taking care of myself. I would ask you about yours, but but I'm, I'm being told we have no time, and they want us to get to a game they okay, want us good, to play. Okay, good, because I don't okay. have one anymore. Okay, so good. All right. Fair enough. <laughs> 
so this is a game called Don't Drop the Ball. This is to test your knowledge of your co-host, Ryan. Jenny. So we're going to ask okay. you questions, and Jenny will give you the answer. Question number one, what is Jenny's preferred New Year's cocktail? <laughs> Jenny's preferred New Year's cocktail would be her spirit brand. Her, her vodka Blondies, brand? Blondies, that's right. Yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. Is that right? Oh, you're awesome. Okay. Yes. See? Who, who is the special. first person Jenny texts to wish Happy New Year? It's got to be Evan or Donnie. Yes, Donnie, so there we go. Smart. Even though I make out with him. What is the craziest New Year's moment you have shared? Uh, there are probably so many of them. One might have been Mariah Carey two years ago. What'd you say? Freezing, Freezing our, butts our butts off. off together. <laughs> All right. Best of luck this year. So Thank looking you forward very to much. watching. Thank you. Thank you. Don't miss it. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.